the cold blood running between the Forum for Democratic Change Secretary General Ali Salaso and leader of opposition in Parliament Nathaniel Mafabi will most likely see one of them leave the party or have to painfully tolerate the other's wrath for life as none of the two appears ready to take the blame. The standoff between the two, which accrues from a petition filed by the Nandala camp following alleged irregularities that surrounded the FDC presidential polls, might see the country's strongest party reduced to tatters. Some of these lies and reckless statements I will point out. The use of the expression recklessly partisan, which is put in this petition, is an amateurish attempt to engage my of the English language. The party's reconciliation committee had hoped to get something positive from the submission of Alice Alasso, but was silenced when, for five hours, Alasso poured scorn on her leader of opposition. Alasso reached an extent of saying how proud she was that she had done anything in her might to put the latter on the same footing with other contestants in the party polls. I have no regrets about that later. My conscience is very clear. And I believe now or later in the lifetime of this party, I will be vindicated. Alasso, who was responding to queries raised by Camp Nandala, including her role in proxy voting, printing excess voter tags, mismanaging the poll funds, hijacking the voting process, among others, Lasha Nandala, calling his petition amateurish and saying that FDC is weak in Elgon region due to him. However, lead petitioner in Nandala camp, Major Ramila Ranga, said Alasso is putting the party in a tight fix whereby members are all going to form camps over the matter. Shame on us, Mr. Chairman, if we fight about our little kingdoms when the entire nation needs deliverance from bad leadership and mismanagement. Shame on us. There was something wrong with her. In fact, you have noted that she even disobeyed the management. Alaso is to appear once again in the committee before the 7th of March, inform the committee how she is not going to step down, saying Mafabi's claims are very weak and do not add up. Now they are seeking equity with tainted hands. How do they expect to get it? They cannot get it from me. So, Mr. Chairman, I am not stepping aside, but I will resign if it comes out as a recommendation. The committee will interface with Camp Nandala to see what the spirits are about Alasso's stance after which a position will be taken. Moses, Television.